my channel. It's me, Zoe. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe, as well as time for fetch my link and code down below. So yeah, today's video is exciting. Obviously, I have my um, hygiene project used up for June. So yeah, um, I have a few items I'm going to put in here. Uh, a lot of them are things I really love, and some of them are like things, things I'm testing out. But I did also use up some things. So yeah, let's get started. So the one item I did finish up, I know, pitiful, is cucumber water the, um, from Pink. This is the exfoliating, refreshing body wash, but it did have exfoliating beads in it. And honestly, I loved this scent. This scent. And I saw that Pink recently came out with their, like, new core line, which is odd because I went on the website and it was only, like, their new core line and literally no none of the other summer scents that were out recently but i'm guessing they put them all back in storage for like some annual sale that's what i'm thinking but they did come out with a new core line and the cucumber um stuff is back in there so honestly i would have purchased stuff in the scent again i don't think i'd buy an oil or a mist or even a lotion in this i just liked it in the shower gel it was a very nice very nice body wash and i really enjoyed it the scent and the texture everything was great Okay, uh, I did not even touch my honey wash this month. This is just way too sweet for right now. It was like 85 today, 80 yesterday, and like 75 like last week. So it's just way too sugary sweet, pine um, not pineapple. I was just talking about a bunch of pineapple body care. My product is wrong, sorry. Um, yeah, just very honey, sweet, sugary. And it's just way too like sugary, sweet honey for me for now. So I will be putting this away to save probably for fall or winter, um, but it is halfway gone and I really do like this body wash. The formula is very nice. It's very moisturizing in my opinion. Um, yeah, I do like it, but again, just too sweet for this time of year in my opinion. Um, and the last thing in the project that I did not finish up, but I did get progress on, um, is the St. Ives Citrus and Cherry Blossom Body Wash. So it was like right here. And I used it a few times and got it down to there. So again, not great progress, but this is 22 fluid ounces. So it's amazing. Very citrusy, hint of floral, very tangy too. And it's like a mandarin orange type of scent. I really do um, like it and I'm happy to keep it for other times. It's not cleanery. It's definitely just an amazing citrus scent. So very happy about this one. And yeah, I would have purchased again. I think you can only find this at Walmart as far as I no. Okay. Now onto the fun new things. Um, this is staying in the project to continue to use. So because I don't really have room for it, um, I'm going to have a basket of <laughs> body washes that I've accrued. But um, yeah, I don't really want to keep that forever because I can always repurchase it and it's only like $5. It's less than $5. So <sighs> yeah, and keeping with the orange theme, I'm also going to be trying to use up or at least halfway. My Dove Glowing Mango and Almond Butter Body Wash. I've never used a Dove Body Wash other than, oh, I think I've used like the Pure Silk one. Well, not for a while though. Oh, the last one I used was the Deep Moisture. I used a few of those and I didn't like them, but I got them in gift sets. And then I used like the Pure Silk one and I love that. And then I had the Gentle Exfoliating, didn't like that one all that much. And then I had the Coconut, and jasmine flower and I like that one but that was a very long time ago that was like like two years ago so yeah I haven't used a Dove body wash in a while especially not like a scented one other than the deep moisture so yeah I got this one let's see the texture looks very extremely moisturizing so yeah, yeah like it's literally it looks like yogurt that's so moisturizing um you'll see how it works but nice soapy almondy hint of mango type of smell so we'll see how i like this and i can close it but yeah got that one um a few other things i know this is bath and Wonderworks brand but i don't really use this like i use my other body care so this will be the hygiene product to use out because it's more on that side this is the steeped invigoration rose tangerine tea luxe bath um, i do want to take some baths this month um and yeah, I've never used this, but I got it. So I you'll see it's a very nice florally springy type scent. Very nice. And I do want to complete this because 
I only have one and it's not really part of my collection or not something I want to collect. Um, same thing with the oil. This is steeped in a fragration again, rose tannery tea body massage oil. It's right there if you can't see. So I do want to complete this. Um, I like this scent a lot and I like this oil, but yeah, I'm just kind of over it since obviously I've used a lot of it. Um, I do like to use this in my baths as like a moisturizing layer. Also like to use this after I've shaved my legs or just in general. So yeah, I gotta try to use this up. It shouldn't be too hard since it's quite low. Okay, a few things from pink I'm trying to use up. I want to finish up my cocoa lotion. So this month I'm gonna focus on using it. Um, I haven't even focused on it recently. I just kind of used whatever. And I mean, I have almost a halfway gone. It's, there's a little on the side, so it's more like right there. So yeah, almost halfway gone, which is great. I love, love this scent. It's amazing. It's amazing, just slightly tropical, slightly sweet, very coconutty fragrance. I do like it, um, and I like the formula as well. So I'll put that back where I usually have it. Um, I want to use it up, um, just because I like it, and they did come out with new packaging. So also want to use up my cocoa oil, coconut oil, body oil. Um, conditioning body oil. I don't know if I'll use this up because I think I've had to use this after every shower. I think even if I use this after literally every shower, I don't think I'm gonna use it up. So we'll see. But if I can get this to like a quarter gone or halfway, that's always good. This doesn't smell as good as the um as the lotion. I'll put some on my skin and see. Again, it's very moisturizing if you can see the glowiness, but definitely not strong. Almost scentless in my opinion, which is okay, but I wish I had more scent. But I guess if I put the lotion on in this, it'll be fine. So I'll probably use this after my showers and then um, go into the lotion once I get to my room. So yeah, excited to use that as well. And again, basically scentless, so yeah. Okay, that is everything for today's Hygiene Project Use Up for this month of June. So I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you later.